Miss Potter, the sequel. Bunnies in bikinis, a melting muskox. However do you imagine these things? She had an imagination that would inspire the world. Because, Mr. Warren, I have an imagination that would inspire the world. This series on what you call global warming, does it have a title? I call it, Miss Potter Gets Hotter in the 21st Century. Everyone thought she was mad, but one man saw the message she had to share. Miss Potter? I'd like to publish your illustrations. Get out of town! Uh, do. Come look. Discover the remarkable. Behold, the globally warmed Arctic hare. Global warming a bonus? No threat to Canadian wildlife? I'm an Arctic hare and I don't even turn white for winter anymore. Peregrine hare, any more of that and I'll paint you out. Uh-oh, she's talking to the bunnies again. And how is my Jeremiah Puddle Duck? Now I'm Jeremiah No Puddle Duck. Quack. Who's quackers here? And here's my favorite. I was large even for a walrus. With the global warming diet for walruses, the pounds just melt away. How many other books have you supervised? A big zero. Want to get hitched? Mr. Warren, are you using the plight of helpless Arctic animals to get some? Well, duh. Finally, some local warming. Beatrix Potter. Hotter and hotter.